Hi dear subscribers, my name is Sanya, welcome to my channel. In today's episode, I'll be guiding you through the process of transforming fine and straight hair into a sleek, sharp, one-line haircut, beautifully framing the face with a rounded outline. So let's dive right in and explore this beautiful transformation together. To begin, I'll be focusing on creating a symmetry using a middle parting. Then, starting from the highest point of the head, I'll create another section that extends from one ear to the other. Next, I'll proceed by extending the central parting down the back of the head. To ensure a precise line, I'll work with horizontal sections, slightly inverted to accommodate the head's tilt. This approach guarantees a straight and accurate result. To start, I'm using a comb to gently create tension, forming a cutting guide for the initial steps. It's all about building a solid foundation, and this step is one of the fundamental basics in achieving our desired haircut. Moving on to the next section, I'm using a parallel sections, mirroring the first one to maintain a consistent and seamless outcome. As the hair increases in density, I'm dividing another section down the middle, roughly as wide as my fingers. This approach will assist me in preserving the symmetry of the haircut. Moving forward, I rely on my fingers to apply the necessary tension while working. Also, remember to maintain a parallel hand or finger position with a section you've separated. It's crucial to consistently align your fingers to ensure accuracy. Don't overlook the importance of occasionally inverting your fingers to uphold the sharp corners of the line. This attention to detail will contribute to the overall precision of the haircut. I continue to replicate these steps until I reach the crown of the head. Consistency is the key to achieving the desired result. Now, let's transition to the sides. If you're finding it challenging to maintain a strong line over the shoulders, here's a helpful trick to ensure symmetry while avoiding the shoulders. As demonstrated in the video, gently tilt your model's head to the left. Ensure that the face remains nearly parallel to the back. From here, create a horizontal section that seamlessly extends from the back section and drape the hair over the back. This technique eliminates the struggle with shoulders and guarantees a seamless process. Once I've completed the process on one side, I'll proceed to replicate the same steps on the opposite side. This symmetry ensures a balanced and harmonious final result. As we move towards the front, my focus is on shaping a delicate and subtle rounded outline. This nuanced detail will infuse a soft and graceful dimension into the haircut's texture. I've divided rounded sections that align harmoniously with the natural contours. It's important to note that for symmetry, your positioning should be in front of the model rather than at the back. Your body's alignment plays a crucial role in shaping various forms effectively. As you can observe, I'm using a low angle while lifting the hair, consistently directing it towards the core of my body. This technique will help me preserve the corners and the length that I established at the back of the haircut. After establishing a guide, I transition to working with mirrored sections while sweeping the hair forward. Beginning with the second section, I opt for a point cutting approach only at the middle section rather than a sharp cut. This choice prevents the creation of sharp lines within the face frame, resulting in a more natural and blended appearance. In the third and final section, I exercise caution while gently over-directing the hair forward. My approach involves utilizing the natural roundness of the head 
ensuring that the hair follows this curvature rather than forcibly pulling it over the top. To maintain consistency, I rely on the middle section and at the back, guaranteeing an equal amount of hair on both sides. This method contributes to a harmonious and well-balanced result. Given the naturally smooth texture of the hair, I use a pedal brush to achieve a polished finish by gently smoothing the ends. These steps contribute to enhancing the overall slickness and refinement of the haircut. To achieve a more textured look, I incorporate the point cutting technique, concentrating on the ends of a depth of about 10 cm. During this phase, I follow the identical sectioning pattern utilized when establishing the base. It's vital to exercise caution and precision while point cutting, as this approach can impact the hair shape. Avoid randomly selecting sections. Instead, apply point cutting thoughtfully to achieve the desired effect while upholding the haircut's integrity. To enhance the outline, follow the same technique by gently tilting the head from one side to other. Allow the hair to naturally fall over her chest and comb it without applying excessive tension. Choose between point cutting or sharper cut based on the hair structure and the desired texture you wish to achieve. This flexibility ensures you achieve the ideal outcome of your envisioned look. In the end, with careful symmetry, expert sectioning and skillful techniques, we've sculpted a haircut that frames the face flawlessly while maintaining a touch of softness. Thank you for joining me today. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to subscribe and follow my YouTube channel for more inspiring hair transformations and expert tips. Bye!